I'm going to be using this phone on my screen so that way I can better demonstrate what, what, what it is we're doing here. First guys, you need to go to um, with a phone. Now if you don't have a phone, you're going to need to get a phone from a parent and either do it on theirs or you could go the long way which hope, let's hope we all do this the easy way which would be to download the Outlook app onto your mobile device. All right, once you got the Outlook app installed, and let me show you how you can install that. And so now I'm going to search for Outlook. And I can actually use my keyboard to be using my phone. And if I look at my phone screen right now, it's mirroring exactly what's on this window on my laptop or computer. So I'm going to choose that one. I think, yeah, that one. You'll recognize it by the logo. Go ahead and, and install that. All right. So this is going to make your life in this class a lot easier, at least for the next assignment. Uh, not now. It's downloading onto my phone. All right, once it's downloaded, go ahead and open the app. And so I'm just controlling this as I would my phone. Go ahead and click on Get Started. And what we're going to do is go ahead and click your school account, but it probably won't be there. So what you're going to have to do is um, type it in. This is going to be the same login and password that you use for Google Classroom. All right, and then go ahead and click on Add Account or sign in. Mine was already there because I had this app and uninstalled it and installed it back. Would you like to add another account? Maybe later. All right, focused inbox. We put the most important actionable emails here. Don't worry about all that. Calendar might be helpful. Search, don't worry about that. All right, so now here's my inbox from school. Okay, so to write an email, once you have the uh, app downloaded, you're gonna click right here on the compose and you're gonna write this email to me. Oops. Okay, so uh, we've got the uh, email right there. Now the subject, remember always put your period and the class title. All right, once you have that, you're gonna to go to the attach, or let's see what happens if I click on the camera. No, I don't wanna take a photo. Well, I, I do, I guess you could do it like this too, but let's say you've already taken the photo. You can click on the paper clip and choose from photo library. Now, I took this really nice picture today in my backyard okay i'm just kidding i downloaded google but what i want you all to do is to go outside in your backyard or so get outside maybe like a park maybe some you know somewhere it's got to be outside um it could be of a cool car it could be of a building it could be of a pet animal just but try to take a really nice picture and what I'll do is I'll download all the pictures and uh, make like a little slideshow video and we'll put that on the YouTube channel. But also, so what are we going to write here in the body of the email? What if, uh, whether you have a keyboard or not, the reason why if you don't have one, we want to see if we could try to get you one possibly. I don't know, I haven't even ran that by anybody. but. You know, I mean, if it's one or two or three of y'all, I'll just buy one for you guys. That's what I'm trying to get at. So put in here, um, yes, if you do have a keyboard or no, if you do not have a keyboard. Okay, yes, if you do have a keyboard, no, if you don't. And go ahead and hit send. Um, once I get that, you um, will have a hundred. All right, guys. Bye.